What's good about your buddy, man? Here today, we're about to do a horror reaction to another uh, Wines Entertainment. And this is actually called Grandmother's Horror Story. Uh, Y'all didn't know Wines uh, Entertainment, you know, sketches always always get me, and I always do like them. So, hey, if we're going to go out further, let's get that. Let's go. When I was in elementary school, I had a friend who lived right next door. We used to go to school together all the time. One day, I was standing in front of my friend's house waiting for her as usual, and I realized that she was kind of strange when she came out. She looked kind of bemused. When I looked more closely, sweat she now. was breaking out in a cold sweat, feeling something strange. I asked my friend what was going on, and she started telling me a story about her dream. She started to dream the same dream she had from long ago. A kind-looking old lady always comes out in her dreams, okay. and she cooks meals for her and then she eats it all. Nothing my friend had a lot of conversations with her because she gave her such a good impression. The most amazing thing was when she woke up. She felt full, as if she had actually eaten, even though it was just a dream. Hmm. My friend lived alone with her maternal grandmother at the time, but on another day when my friend was about to go to school, she repeatedly requested one thing from her with a scary face. Do not follow the stranger, or anyone today, okay? Do not. Okay. My friend was confused for a moment, but reassured her grandmother, telling her not to worry and then went to school. However, nothing happened all day. And that night, she fell asleep, and the old lady appeared in her dream as usual, and made her a meal. She was enjoying her meal, and all of a sudden, the old lady asked my friend to go somewhere with her. She held the old lady's hand and tried to follow her thoughtlessly. However, she then remembered what her grandmother said to her in the morning, so she let go of her hand and refused to go. Then she saw her face turn scary at that moment. He wasn't ready! What the hell? The old lady suddenly grabbed the back of my friend's neck and began to drag her well, somewhere. Technically she grabbed no the front matter of her how shirt. hard she tried to escape, she wouldn't budge at all. While she was trembling with fear, she then remembered the other thing that her grandmother had told her in the morning. If you're dragged by someone in your dreams, don't panic. Just slam your head against somewhere like a wall or a pillar. Then you will wake up from your dream. Understand? My friend who remembered the advice saw a tree in front of her and tried to hit her head, but suddenly, the old lady laughed as she pulled my friend's head. Who taught you this? What oh, the hell? I see. Your grandmother did. So she failed to wake up and was being dragged away from her dream and the old lady's cane suddenly caught her eye. At that moment, she bumped her head with all her strength on the stick and then finally woke up from her dream. I got goosebumps listening to what my friend hell? since it was early in the morning. Anyway, my friend who had been absent-minded all day started skipping school the following day. I was worried about her, so I went to her house. But the door didn't open, and she didn't answer the phone. A month later, my friend called me, and she asked me to come over to her house. With curiosity, I ran to her house. And when I saw her again, she looked emaciated, and the atmosphere around her was quite different. Most of all, she oh. kept laughing to herself like crazy. Ah! She dragged me into the house, took me to a room, and said this. Hey, you see my granny? She's crazy. Then she began to giggle more, and I unconsciously turned my eyes to the room. Her grandmother, looking into the air continuously, was begging desperately in a small, tiny room without a beam of light. Her face seemed afraid of something, and she kept muttering the same words. I didn't teach her. That was not me. Please. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Later, I heard that her grandmother had passed away shortly after, what the hell? and my friend has been hospitalized because of the shock. Come to think of it now, 
Wasn't the food she always ate in her dreams a meal for her grandmother, who would die soon? Oh. Oh, bro. Um, first off, I wouldn't be going to sleep. My ass would sleep in the daytime. Because, uh, yeah, every time you go to sleep at night, you see that, that same dream, which is the same exact dream your grandmother had, and y'all doing that? No, hell no. I see dead people. Mm -mm. No, not happening. I will be taking some nodos, some coffee every day, going to black, uh, <laughs> anything with caffeine in it, Red Bull, <laughs> Monster, Joker, something. <laughs> I'll be taking everything possible to keep my ass woke. I would not be, damn that, no. Mm -mm. No. No. Hell no. Bruh. You got a creepy, a creepy grandma in the morning. You got a creepy thing at night. That's dragging you in the middle of nowhere. You had no clue that all of a sudden y'all both you know, getting captured like that. Nah, we good. But for all that, just auto, just automatically put me in the mental. <laughs> like for real, that's, that's not happening at all. But uh, anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and end it right there. I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, please be sure to comment, like, and subscribe. Like, hey, I told you, I, I got to do something just this Halloween. So uh, I got, I think I got something in mind for Halloween day. I'm not exactly sure, but I'm gonna figure out something. And it's like literally what to the twenty. It's like next week, Lord. Ooh. Anyway, but um, anyway, um, go ahead. Like I said, end it right here. In the meantime, between time I see you when I see how to your boy. Peace.